The warm sun rose on a quiet grassy home where lived many creatures free to roam. The sweet smell of flowers filled the air and a soft breeze to brush your hair. The peaceful sound of the singing birds and the beauty of the grazing herds happy under the warm sun, all of course, except for one. A single caterpillar sat, sad and alone, for he did not fit to this glorious tone. He was ugly and fat and ever so slow, the other creatures would laugh and make him feel low. He knew he was different, ugly and lame. But he decided that he would become the same. He climbed up high to the tallest tree and wrapped himself up for all to see. The others still laughed and they didn't care until one day the caterpillar had something to share. He broke out of his wrapped up cocoon and spread out wings as if to bloom. The once ugly caterpillar tricked the eye, for now he was a beautiful butterfly. He flew from his home down to the ground, with all the creatures rising as they would gather round. The insects, the bugs, the birds, and the bees came out from under and down from trees. They're all amazed at what he had become, and now wished their remarks could just be undone. The butterfly didn't speak, just stood there with class. Then he thought to himself, time to kick some fucking ass. Butterfly looked like an angel from heaven. His hatred filled his heart and grabbed his AK-47. The butterfly laughed and took off into the air. The creatures felt sorry, but he just didn't care. They cried out his name and they began to yell. Then he replied, Kiss my ass, I'll see you in hell. His eyes turned red as his blood started to boil. The others were fearful and decided to recoil. They were all too late as the bullets flew down. The butterfly laughed like a fucked up. He crippled many so they couldn't run and flew to the ground to have some real fun. He tore off wings and started fires and tossed in little bugs like they were tires. He lifted up beetles and then watched them fall and drove the bunnies' heads straight into a wall. He used pine cones, rocks, and thorns for then they sent in the strong arm of the ants. The butterfly pounded and killed one by one, and never did he stop until the job was done. The sky turned red, and the sun began to fall. Demon Butterfly had beaten them all. The warm sun rose as it did each day. Much was different, I have to say. There was no sweet smell to fill the air, and no breeze to rush through your hair. There was no sound of singing birds, nor any sign of the grazing herds. The blood-soaked butterfly sat 
with a grin. He knew this was his glorious day to win. For those who survived, he kept his slaves and ruled like a king for the rest of his days. The moral of the story is quite close at hand. I'm sure it's easy for you to understand. But when you go to sleep, best keep aware. The butterfly may strike. Hero Knight.